You think you're advanced, do you? You've got your smartphone in one hand, a smartwatch in the other, and you're ready to take on the world, right? Well, let's see how you measure up on the cosmic scale and how far we've come as a species. Buckle up, it's going to be a wild ride. And, who knows, maybe we'll even find out if we're ready for the next level. Or not. Alright, let's start with the basics. Back in 1964, a Russian astrophysicist named Nikolai Kardashev came up with a way to classify civilizations based on their energy consumption and technological prowess. The idea, the more advanced a civilization is, the more energy it can harness and control. Sounds simple, right? But hold on to your lattes, because things are about to get interesting. We've got six types of civilizations on the Kardashev scale, ranging from prehistoric cave dwellers to gods of the multiverse. So, let's get started with our humble beginnings. Type 0, where it all began. These poor souls hadn't yet discovered the joys of fossil fuels or even how to make a decent fire. Muscle power and simple tools were all they had. But let's not be too hard on them, we all have to start somewhere, right? Now, we're on the verge of becoming a Type 1 civilization, or planetary civilization. This is where we harness the power of our entire planet, control natural disasters, and build a truly global society. We're not quite there yet, though. In fact, we're at around Type 0.7 so close, yet so far. But hey! At least we're not stuck in the Stone Age, right? Moving up the ladder, we've got Type 2, the Stellar Civilization. These guys have taken over their entire star system and can do incredible things like build Dyson Spheres to capture all of their star's energy. They can even create stars if they want to. And don't worry about getting lost in space, Type 2 civilizations have got interstellar travel covered with advanced propulsion systems. It's just a shame we're not quite there yet. But we at least got Elon Musk, right? This is Elon Musk. Now, things are getting serious. Type 3 civilizations have gone full-on galactic, mastering the resources and energy of an entire galaxy. They can manipulate the structure of galaxies and have probably encountered other advanced civilizations. You know, just your everyday extraterrestrial stuff. And with their ability to travel across the galaxy, these guys make the Starship Enterprise look like a rusty old bicycle. But don't worry, we're not jealous at all. Are you sure about that? Now, strap in, because we're about to enter the realm of the hypothetical, the cosmic superpowers of the Kardashev scale. These civilizations are so advanced that they're almost incomprehensible to our puny human minds. Type 4 civilizations have harnessed the energy of an entire universe. They've transcended physical limitations, mastered space-time manipulation, and might even have the ability to create or destroy entire universes. Can you imagine that? It's like having a cosmic remote control. But wait, there's more. If Type 4 wasn't enough for you, how about Type 5? No, God, please, no, no! These hypothetical civilizations operate on a multiversal level, controlling the energy of multiple universes and influencing or creating the laws of physics. They can travel between universes like we travel between cities. I mean, why stop at one universe when you can have them all, right? So, we've explored the Kardashev scale, and it's been one heck of a ride. But now, it's time to get serious. What does all this mean for us, humanity? Are we ready to level up? Are we even capable of it? Well, the truth is, we've got a long way to go. But we've also come a long way. Our progress as a species has been nothing short of incredible, and we've got the potential to achieve so much more. But reaching those higher levels of the Kardashev scale isn't just about technology and energy. It's also about how we grow as a society, how we collaborate, and how we overcome the challenges that face us. 
To truly level up, we need to be smarter, more compassionate, and more united than ever before. So, are we ready to take on this challenge? To become the cosmic overachievers we know we can be? Well, that's up to us. Let's make it happen. Thank you for joining us on this wild journey through the Karashev scale. We hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have. If you want to keep exploring the cosmos with us, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. Let's get a conversation going. And do check out Cogni Plus app, which is made just for curious people like you. Until next time, stay curious, and keep reaching for the stars.